is going on guys welcome back to the channel critical overlord here so production is set to begin this upcoming thursday in wilmington north carolina in on um halloween kills the sequel to blumhouse's 2018 reboot of the franchise which is actually a sequel to the original film all that good stuff the film as we know is going to bring back jamie lee curtis presumably judy greer andy matichak uh, nick castle is going to be back for his little sporadic appearances as the shape james drew courtney will be back as michael myers uh kyle richards actually got announced to come back as little lindsey wallace from the original film anthony michael hall will be participating as tommy doyle and i think they just announced someone else to be returning not returning but play a returning character i believe lonnie from the first film where dr loomis told him to get away from the myers house lonnie's supposed to be back and i believe lonnie is the father of the boy that allison or addison dated in the 2018 film so it'll be interesting to see how Lonnie factors into this. But yeah, production is supposed to begin later this week, Thursday in North Carolina. Um, I'm looking forward to see what comes out once everything commences. What behind the scenes photos will we see? Will they have like, we're going to get another clear indication of what the story will be about. I actually wrote an article about the topic. I'm going to leave that article down in the description about the news that I wrote it on. I wrote about the uh, production starting this week. So I'll leave a link to that article that I wrote down in the description or in the comment section as well. But Halloween Kills is supposed to begin production later this week on Thursday. And the report coming from the news station in the area that the uh, movie supposed to be filmed in mentions that they're going to be covering footage for a specific dialogue or some type of news coverage dialogue. That's what they're going to be filming. So to me, it sounds like Halloween Kills, based off of that, is going to be picking up where the 2018 film left off. Now, whether or not the entire movie will be set where the 2018 film left off has yet to be seen. It's not yet known what exactly the overall story will be set in. But I'm hoping this is a good indication that not only Halloween Kills, but hopefully Halloween Ends takes place immediately after the events of the 2018 film because you can have all three movies set in that same night it's possible of course halloween kills will have to be like maybe across i want to say maybe three four hours and then halloween ends could be across the remainder leading up into the morning on uh, november 1st it's, it's possible what it's possible what they can do uh, they didn't specify a time in Halloween 2018, I don't believe. But of course, you'll have people who will go back and nitpick to find like the clocks to see what the clock said. But who cares? Anyway, that's all I have for you guys today. Halloween Kill starts production this week. If you haven't already, make sure you subscribe and turn on post notifications so you never miss a video. In the description, I'll have links to all my social media accounts, my Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram. You can message me there to let me know if there's any movies, news, or reviews you would like me to cover in the future. With all that in mind, guys, I will see you in the next video.